Okay. <laughs> yo, hey, yo, hey, 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 ooh, ooh, giving you psychopath, giving you bad skin, giving you looks, giving you cutie. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today we are back with another video. Somebody needs to give me a trophy for being consistent because surely I cannot be consistent for Justin J, you know? But anyway, if you are a first time viewer, welcome to my channel. I am Joanne Mashawa and if you are returning, thank you so much for returning. Please click the subscribe button down there, press the bell notification so you know whenever I post a video which is every Friday and yeah, become, become part of the family. So today we are doing a let's talk about it. I don't know if this is going to become a series or what, but basically there won't be any demos basically demonstration of anything today we're basically just gonna talk about the matter at hand or the products at hand because obviously we are a channel that is beauty based so we're gonna be dealing a lot with products and so today I wanted to do something more skin related because I don't wanna have to wear any makeup because <laughs> skin is goishing <laughs> but it'd be like that it'd be like that <laughs> but anyway um so I wanted to just do something skin like like I just said or skin related and that is what we are doing today. So today we are talking about the Neutrogena Hydro Booster range. So this range is not something new and it's probably not the first time you're going to hear about it here on my channel and if it is then I am glad to have put you on. <laughs> But basically the Neutrogena Hydro Boost range is obviously a skincare line or release that was released about in 2016 or so because it has been here for some time but I think it only started becoming popular in South Africa like 2018-2019 so yeah a lot of people use the range especially because of what it is for which is hy uh, hydration and a lot of people obviously prioritize that in the skin not even a lot of people everyone should prioritize hydration in their skincare routine so for that reason a lot of people are aware of the hydro boost range because of what it does and some people are only becoming aware of it now and some people are obviously thinking of trying it for the very same reasons that i and many other people who do use the range do yeah for the same reasons <laughs> but so i just want to talk about it because some people do tend to ask guys do you think the hydro the neutrogena hydro boost range is really the girl that she thinks she is and is it good for the skin and how has your skin reacted to the range and i just want to say firstly then disclaimer like big exclamation mark this I am not a skin therapist, I am not a dermatologist, I am not an esthetician, I am none of that. Nah. So whatever I share on this platform is my two cents and if you want to take my two cents and make use of it, that is great. That makes me happy that you can like listen to me and learn something from me. Nah. But also don't hold me against the things I say. Like. Okay, I, I'll, I'll say things with my chest, but don't be like, um, sis, you said this is purely my experiences and my opinions. If you experience anything otherwise, then it's okay. You know, we're all not the same, but you know, I just wanted to put that out. And also, people's skin is different. So, the range may have worked perfectly well for me. It may have done what it needed to do. It may have even cleared up my skin in the process, but... For you, it may do the complete opposite, and that's just as an our skin, you know? So I just wanted to put that disclaimer out there before I go any further with the video. So yeah, that's great. The Hydro Boost range is to boost hydration in your skin, and they do this through the cleansers, micellar water, 
um, exfoliators and then obviously important things, moisturizers and serums, right? There are many, many products in this line. I couldn't really pinpoint all the products because I personally have seen many of the products in my local clicks or discam, which is where you can buy the Hydro Boost range um, if you want, especially more products of the Hydro Boost range. So I have seen a lot of the products, but when I looked up the products online, like on the clicks website for one, and the discam website, and even Neutrogena's um, website not all the products were there so i was quite confused whether they were discontinued or they just you know not as important anymore or not considered part of the range but anyway i'm just gonna give you the knowledge based on more or less what you can get at your clicks local clicks and this came and what was also on the websites the neutrogena website so okay cool like i said there are a bunch of products in this range ranging from cleansers and micellar water and exfoliators to moisturizers eye creams and serums right so i don't have all the products and i haven't used all the products right so i'm not going to obviously give a review on things that i have never used this is not necessarily a review but like we're just speaking about it so i'm not going to give a review or opinion on things i have never used because then that's just my assumptions and assumptions they don't work period poo so the hydro boost range includes a cleanser which is a what which is a water gel cleanser and yeah neutrogenous hydro boost water gel cleanser then they have an exfoliator and micellar water those i have never used but they are available Part of the hydro boost range and you can get a discam and clicks last time i checked and then they have a serum and an eye cream eye cream i have never used also of the two similar moisturizers out of the three moisturizers in the hydro boost range are the water gel and gel cream moisturizers right the gel cream being the one that is more suitable for sensitive skin and the water gel one being the one that's more suitable for normal and combination skin or normal to combination skin according to what i saw on the clicks website so because we do our research uh, <laughs> so those are part of the two similar moisturizers they come in a jar gel cream it's why it's simple that's that right then another moisturizer is the city shield protector that is one of the moisturizers, but the difference with this one is that it is uh, more of a um, protection for your skin more than a moisturizer and also to provide your skin with something that is very important and I want all my black people to hear this out. Sun protection. Protection from the sun, sunscreen, UV, rain protection. It is important one of the most important things you can give your skin okay it's important so those are the products that are part of the hydro boost range according to my knowledge and according to my research right so like i said i have the gel the water gel cleanser and or have used have the water gel cleanser the supercharged serum and one of the moisture two of the three moisturizers and one of the two similar moisturizers i have the gel cream and the city shield protector so basically these are all the products Oof, so goey. these are all the products that i'm referring to all neutrogena you see neutrogena should just give me some coins for supporting them and you know what but anyway, so these are the products that I currently have, that I have used and love, but we will go into that a bit more because I'm going to just speak about them one by one and then... So we know basically what they do and we can just basically round off my two cents about the whole range. So we'll start with the most obvious, um, the cleanser, because let's just start with how our skincare routine should go. So. 
this is the hydro boost gel cleanser one thing i did forget to mention guys you 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 embarrass you know neutrogena also does have um wipes part of the hydro boost range i'm so sorry embarrassing so this is the hydro boost cleanser the water gel cleanser so basically the aim of this cleanser is to boost hydration and leaving the and leave the skin very supple and fresh and hydrated right and it also removes makeup which is very important for me like for some other people that may not be important but like that's very important for me and yeah it, it's just you know when a cleanser specifically says that great for makeup removal it makes it so great for me because then i don't have to use like 50,000 cleansers and go through 50,000 steps to try and remove my makeup so i usually just go in like once or twice with this and then like tone if i'm toning or, or exfoliate if i'm exfoliating but this now guys this is worth the coins okay this is like a 10 out of 10 guys um i am going through it quite quickly um as you can see and i got this like in may so i don't know if i finished a month but i am going through it quite quickly but if it's a cleanser like it makes sense and if it's one of those cleansers that i use every day which i do then it makes sense that it is that far and i feel like guys if something if you can see that something is depleting then clearly i must be doing the right things and i just want to say that most of these products specifically the products that i do have are infused or made with hyaluronic acid which is an acid that your skin naturally forms and it helps the, the retention of water in the skin which is important for hydration so that's why they call it the hydro boost range most of the products have hyaluronic acid which is essential 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 and i think the price that these products also retail for with hyaluronic acid and the function that they function you know whether it's a moisturizer or it's a serum or it's a cleanser i think it's pretty cool and pretty affordable so that's a 10 out of 10 from me so um i feel like i'm rambling i thought this video was gonna be short but like hey so my favorite 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 guys this is like my favorite product of the whole range this is what introduced me to the hydro boost range so basically this is the neutrogena hydro boost um capsule and serum supercharged booster the serum is really the girl that she thinks she is it also has um hyaluronic acid capsules as you can see down there the white capsules or balls are Oh guys, in the go uh, my serum is almost finished. Um, so which also aids in making sure that your skin is extra extra hydrated. So now imagine starting off your cleansing routine or your whole skincare routine with hydration and putting in more hydration. It's just like so the next product is the hydro boost gel cream the gel cream and this is like a gel obviously and it's not like it's not like runny but it, it does have like a tacky sticky feeling and i don't use this in my um morning skincare routine because i feel like i need extra moisture during the day i don't like it when i can feel that my skin is lacking moisture and as a moisturizer i do use something else and then in the evening when i feel like i'm more relaxed especially after wearing makeup i don't like feeling heavy after having makeup on i love this before i go to bed and remember that it's also important to wash your face at night because that's when your face does the or your skin does the most work and that's when all the goodness happens so wash your face before you sleep especially if you have makeup on don't sleep with makeup guys please please don't sleep with makeup on so i love 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 this for my nighttime skincare routine it's yeah I don't know, I'm not really a big fan of it, but like it, it does the job. Also great for hydration. It's very lightweight, so you don't feel that your skin is hydrated. 
and that's what I love about it is that I don't feel it so it's great for at night because like I said I don't want to feel a lot of things at night so in the morning I want to feel that okay I'm hydrated before I go on and live my day because also I like looking radiant so I don't need all that at night like nights I can be toned down so but anyway this is a really great product too lightweight does the job, does the hydration, quickly absorbs into your skin so you don't feel it, doesn't leave you looking shiny also. And I think that's also a great thing. Certain products in this range don't leave you looking shiny. The serum and the gel cream don't leave you looking shiny. So if you do have oily skin and you don't like that oily skin appearance, your skin is not going to look oily. It's going to look refreshed, man, like glowy and dewy in a good way. So the last product is the City Shield Hydrating Lotion with SPF 50, no I like 25 yo. The City Shield Hydrating Lotion appears as a blue gel, not gel but like a cream, yeah I get cream, yeah it's a cream and this I love because it protects your skin obviously it's some protection i think the l that Eugenia took with this whole range is not to include this spf in the water gel or gel cream like you could have just saved us our money now we love you but you could have saved us our money and put it in that and all these properties because wow take up now imagine putting fifty thousand things on your face but nonetheless, I think it's pretty cool or I think the product is pretty cool because we do, especially if you like live in metros, big metros, a lot is happening and the air. So it's good that you know that you have that protective layer over your face, over your skin to protect it because that definitely does, 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 does influence how your skin looks, how your skin is. and. You know, especially breakouts around this area, you might find that you're breaking out and you think when I, no, maybe it's that coke that I drank, or no, maybe it's because like I'm about to go on my period, but no, honey, it's the environment doing you dirty, boo. So it's great if you can, if you can put something over your skin that will shield you and protect you from all that while protecting you from UVA and UVB rays. So don't say i never plugged you on anything guys never ever ever never say i don't plug you with anything and also besides protecting your skin from all the pollutants in our environment it also does give you a radiant look which you can see on my face like if you can see this young glow that i have it's definitely the city shield lotion because yeah city shield hydrating lotion it's really top two and yeah it's top two <laughs> it's top two i think it's my second favorite honestly if i have to be honest from the whole range it's really amazing and i do think it's worth the coins i i'm a jackie i understand and jackie i told me that i must wear my spf every day and besides like jackie i guys like it's just and also SPF, that one, that one in Nivea or whatever one, that one you see for kids or whatever, that is for your body, boo. Don't put that thing on your face. Don't put it on your face. You must buy something for your for your face specifically. And guys, please put on your SPF. So everything ranges from like a hundred rand to two hundred rand. Nothing too hectic. You might leave the store having spent close to a thousand rand, but I definitely think it's worth it if you can. That's if you buy the whole range. I mean, you don't have to buy the whole range. Like, even if you have, like, one thing. So, basically, to sum up my experience with the products, which I have basically kind of told you throughout this whole video, I am very happy with the products for the most part. I have not noticed or experienced any breakouts from using the product. If you are concerned about that and you have acne-prone skin, and it is suitable for all skin types so whether you have no normal oily combination skin dry skin sensitive skin the only time where i kind of react to the product is when my skin is torn because of my eczema then like the products tend to burn but that is just in the areas where i have that um that flare up of eczema but other than that 
me and the products there are Neutrogena Hydro Boost face masks so you can also check that out at your local clicks or discount also have never used but I hear good things about them but obviously I wouldn't know and yeah guys hydration is very important for your skin especially now during winter these products I have been using so basically that is the hydro boost range from me I think it's a really cool range um, this is an open platform safe space free space loving space so I'd really like to hear what you guys think about the hydro boost range have you ever used it before what is your skin like and how did your skin react to it so that you know other people can obviously learn from it and know what to expect to when they are buying the products yeah so that we just you know enlighten each other and you know but like i said in the beginning of this video what works for me may not work for you so you might find that your skin reacts negatively to the product or to the range and my skin reacts positively you really just need to find what works for you but in terms of hydration and also you know which is my biggest concern and i have said this in my foundation routine and i said that hydration is very important in my skin and skincare is obviously very important and a very important base to start your makeup on so yeah to have very great makeup application you need to have happy skin and for me that would be by hydrating my skin and the Neutrogena Hydro Boost range does exactly that. Like I said, please comment in the comment section and tell me what your thoughts are on this range. Have you tried it? Are you planning on trying it? And also if you have anything to share about it or the Neutrogena products in general or perhaps an alternative which would be great. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. Tell me if you would like to see more talk throughs or maybe I should include demos of me doing or using the products but like best believe like you can see that the products are almost depleted but best believe that I do use them and yeah just if you enjoyed this video give it a big 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 thumbs up subscribe to my channel if you haven't and I hope to see you next time.